We are speaking with Coach Curtis Kitchens, Kitchens of the Seattle Seahawks of the DFW Miniature Football League. Coach Curtis, what are you expecting out of the Seahawks in this upcoming season? <coughs> this is the second year. Last year we were known as a team that un unusually could pass to a degree but had no running game. This year we're going to have a running game, but we're still going to be able to pass. So with that being the case, we expect to win a game. <laughs> Unlike last year, we came on the close. But uh, so that that's the number one improvement, just in the in the in the quality of our play, with the players individually, and then being able to run now. We got uh, we got a whole lot more speed and a little bit more strength at this time. But the off season is over. What about your defense? As far as the defense is concerned, it's just it's just going to be a little bit more strength, a little bit more of the same. We got we ordered some special figures before we only had limited poses and things, and so we we were really tied up as far as cornerbacks and things of that nature. But we've got special poses coming. Maybe maybe take away some passes from people who could kill us before that way, uh, and then. The primary thing we need to do with defense and what we're going to do is work on uh, scrimmaging and learning you know, best ways to cook because we were kind of thrown into the fire last year and, we, and, and uh, learned on the fly and then put a whole lot of time into it. This year it was a little bit more practice, especially with game clock management type stuff and we'll read the rules again, try to get all that understood <laughs> and then we're going to, hopefully that will help us you know, improve that way too. What type of schemes are you uh, running this year? We'll, we'll let you know when we play. <laughs> <laughs> What's uh, your uh, hope philosophy? Uh, is it aggressive or is it, you know, just yeah. whatever the other squad offers me, you know, I'll take uh, it? I like, I, I like to think you other people maybe script you play. I don't know how that plays in this kind of league, but you know, there we need we're gonna work on some plays that I know get some guys open and then throw them in at certain points in the game. Now this is the goal. So we're gonna see how that goes. But yeah, you know the the idea is to score but not get too crazy. I don't wanna I don't wanna take unnecessary risk. You know, if if, if I need to kick a field goal, I'd like to think that the defense is gonna do its job too. So that's just going to be the philosophy is just win without just doing crazy stuff and trying to go for it and do uh, things. Like, yeah, you can't even win a coin flip and get the ball first, something like that. It's sort of that psychological effect of yarding a touchdown. We'll see how those can prove at this point with our team. That's, that's the concept. Yeah, So what any any predictions on this season uh, as far as what yeah. you expect to do? Do you think that you can be a playoff caliber team in your second year in the league? Or, I mean, you, yeah. uh, what are your your goals? You know, obviously the goal is to win as much as possible. That's everything. But what I predict is that we're going to win as many games as we can but uh, if, if we get into the playoffs and, and even win a game there, that's going to be just going to be my expectation. For this second season, for the other season, after this one, that's the realistic expectation. So, you know, everybody, everybody theoretically, yeah, I'm going to win it all. But judging from some of the skill that I've seen from the other players, you know, just to be realistic expectation, since I'm the only, since I'm the coach, you know, you could also That's right. Was that cheesy as all? Hi. <laughs> <laughs>